So the next little bit here has to deal with some um, interesting drama kind of going on on kick right now. It has to deal with the VTuber community, but it applies. I think it applies to the entire platform because I'm curious to see what you guys have to say about it. Okay. Curious to see what you guys have to say about it. But anywho, there's a little bit of thing going on here. So basically, um, I looked into this a little bit. There's this one streamer who's a VTuber on kick who supposedly they go around, uh, I've seen screenshots and stuff, they go around a bunch of different, um, a bunch of different VTuber channels, whether they're online or offline, and says a bunch of like bad things in their chat. I don't have the, I never bookmarked the tweet that has like the images of the proof or whatever, but um. There's a whole bunch of like, uh, they, they say a bunch of bad stuff in chats and stuff like, uh, and, and a lot of people are classifying it as harassment and they have proof of them doing it because they're on an alt account and yeah. But anyways, um, yeah, so there's a, there's a, there's a, you know, a VTuber that I've heard of quite a bit, been featured a lot and all this and that. But anyways, I am sick and tired of this. At Kick Support, I hope you will look into it and read all the posts regarding the situation, this one included. I and all of the streamers for the past couple of months, not weeks, months, have turned to you regarding this person. We trusted staff to help us and turned in so much evidence supporting that this person and their community have had come to our online and offline chats to harass, bully, and throw baseless accusations in sentences riddled with derogatory terms. Months we have been getting emails stating we will look into it. Thank you for your interest in kick, which I will admit that is um, that that is very true. That is literally kick's response. Okay, one of your verified creators left platform due to bullying. Okay, I don't I don't know who that who that was. Um, and every time this person does something with evidence in your face, you turn your backs on creators who are truly trying to build you. Uh, your community time and time we are let down you spoke about future at stake eddie is this kick's future harassment being not addressed creators being free to attack other creators is uh is that what kick streaming was made for okay and actually this post has the evidence in it so uh, again so so quite interesting but Let's let's talk about um let's let's go into into this right here. So here is some of the here's some of the evidence here that was um uh you know kind of posted a little bit uh again in some you know offline channels and stuff a star staringle and um you know you're a scammer clout chasing watch yourself who do you think you are um I don't Actually, let me double check these and make sure that there isn't anything like really, really, really bad that I don't want to show on stream. Okay, that one's censored. That one's censored. And that one's fine. Okay. So then we have then we have this one here uh, again in, in another channel instance. Um uh somebody else here, a different name, but you have Star Angle down here at the bottom again. Okay. And then you have a star angle in this channel. Um, and again, it's only VTubers. And B boy, you're nothing but a straight simp, you loser. And then we got another one. Um, you're next, effing nobody, nobody likes you, F out of here, trash model. Okay. And um, well, in this clip here, uh, the evidence that they have is that they open up Google. And they got to choose what account to sign into. And one of them was was a, a, a Google account named Star Ingle. So people are, are are suggesting that this person is that person, that account going around doing that stuff uh, on an alternate uh, account. And apparently there's um a bunch more evidence or a bunch more things kind of going around all over the place here anyways. But um my question, my question, and the reason I bring this up is, do you think, 
what is what is your opinion on this? You guys in the chat, what is your opinion on this? Do you think that um, this should be something that should be uh, banned? Should they get in trouble for this? Or what do you what do you guys think? Like based on what I showed you right there, what do you guys think? IP ban is <laughs> glad. Kick will never do an IP ban. Okay, Kick will never ever do an IP ban. They will not. No, they said nothing. They were just uh, talking crap. In all seriousness, yes, Kick should step in and actually do some work. Was Staringle not banned from their chat? Well, some no, some of these people did not have this account banned in their chat because they they didn't. They just didn't have the account banned in their chat, right? They, they just didn't have it. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's kind of like that's uh, that's all the streamer can do, right? Right. I mean, obviously, yeah, the, the streamer could just ban them from the chat, right? Just just ban them, you get them out of there, right? Of course, of course. Um, but like, yeah, I mean. Streamers should just ban them every time. Yeah, like, but that's the thing, though, is that if there's somebody, you know, knowingly, is Star Angle uh, behavior against TOS? If yes, then why not ban? If no, then mass site bullying. allows it. See, that's that's the hard part about it. That's the hard part about it. Because um, if we go take a... Let, let's go take a look. A, a, let's go deep dive a, a little bit into the um community guidelines shall we the the new community guidelines let's go deep dive into it a little bit and, and kind of see would this classify as a um as a thing i think it might be that one up there but let me see if there's um let me see self-destructive behavior uh let me see if there's anything else. Okay, no. Okay, so I think it's in this section here. Violence and hate speech. Let's see. You guys give me your opinions. Shush, shush, shush. This is serious. So violence and hate speech. There is no violence or hate speech allowed on kick. We are committed to fostering a diverse and respective, uh, respectful community. Oh, my God. We strictly prohibit unwanted and intentional violence, and we do not allow our platform to be used for hate speech, encouraging or participating in violence or bullying others under the guise of just joking or free speech is counterproductive to the mission of kick creators and chatters who engage in or promote violence or hate based speech through slurs or recognize hate speech language will face enforcement actions. Violence can occur in a variety of ways. It may or may not include the use of weapons, but often leads to injury or harm. Dangerous competitions, dares, or pranks can lead to violence. Strictly no illegal violence against animals will be tolerated. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Hate speech. We understand context is critical in determining the occurrence of hate speech. We consider hate speech to be any... Uh, commentary without context, which directly or indirectly negatively targets an individual or demographic group with threats of violence or statements of hate. Um, let's see. So that wouldn't be like anything targeted there, but this right. Uh, oh yeah. Watch yourself. I mean, that's okay. It's a, it's a stretch, but. Hate speech violations include, but are not limited to, encouraging or inciting others to participate in acts that may cause harm, abuse and or discussion around wanting to harm others, engaging in uh, brigading, hate hosting, or weaponizing your chat or community against another community, promoting or spreading hate speech or discrimination related to gender, gender identity. Okay, that's not, uh, doesn't have to deal with what we're doing here. Engaging in cyberbullying, doxing, or harassment of individuals or groups based on personal characteristics or beliefs. So I think, 
I think is that a uns pancake emote? Um, I think this would be the one that would probably be the be the most right. Engaging in cyberbullying, doxing, or harassment of individuals or groups based on personal characteristics or beliefs. Um. Yeah, I mean, they're obviously it's only a VTubers, right? It only applies to VTubers. Uh yeah. Ultimately, here's the thing. This this is kind of like on the edge of where Kick actually would do something about it, I think. Um, I believe they said in their post that their VTuber has the community harass others too. Yeah, but we don't have proper evidence of it unless people are saying that like these people right here are um like from their community or whatever, but there, there's no evidence provided here. So at the end of the day, we we don't know. We got to take it at, at what we do know. So um, I think so. And further down. Yeah, of course. Just found out uh, more evidence of another account that's directly tied to them. It never ends. Um, yeah, I mean, ultimately we, we just need, we need the proper evidence to, to be able to show that their community is being used as we weaponizing. But so here's the thing, let's get down to business. D do you think kick should do something about it? And if so, what should kick do? Okay. If so, what should kick do any update on weird emotes? To be honest, I don't think the emotes on Kick are very lenient. I don't think they will do anything to them, to a majority of them. They got to be really bad. There's a lot of crap talk on here and none of it gets banned. Let's be honest. I get it if they were making death threats or saying uh, henuous things, slurs and such, but it seemed like standard hate watching. A few day ban, depending on how bad the harassment is. Death breaks TOS and kick should do something about it, but they won't. I, I mean, I based, based again, based on what I know about kick, this is Axel. No, no. This is not enough uh, for Kick to really do anything about it. Um, uh, Axel, no. Hey, no, no. Drop it. Drop it. No. Take the ball. Yeah, it is. It's not allowed to bounce. Um, but yeah, no. So I, based on what I know about kick and stuff like that, I, I don't think they're going to do anything about it. If it was like really, really like, you know, uh, racist or they're, they're going to tell you that they're, they're going to come find you and kill you or something like that, then, then that would, that would be more implied to kick doing something about it. But unfortunately, based on kicks rules, I, I don't think they will do anything. All they will say, all they will say is just ban them from your channel. Unfortunately, that that's, that's basically it. Uh, all that they will say is just ban them from your channel. That, that is, that is all they'll really do, to be honest with you. Um, whether it's right or wrong is obviously up for, for debate and stuff like that. But, uh, I mean, yeah, I kick, kick is, uh, you know, still harassment. Give them a three day ban and see if they continue. If they, uh, if they do go harder, if not, then leave it. Yeah. Something should be done about it. I mean, I would, I would agree. I, I would say, I would say due to the uniqueness of a name of star angle, the fact that that other VTuber and they have a clip of a Google account named the exact same thing, Star Angle. 
Uh, I would say that's that's pretty solid evidence. Star Engel is not a very common name. Okay, that's not a very that's a pretty unique name in my opinion. So, um, yeah. But um, the other accounts and stuff again, I don't know. You need like this here, like yeah. Sadly, again, this right here, like based off of these messages, no lives get y'all uh effing butts off this platform. Just bro, um, that that is just I know Star Angle's at the bottom, but like something like this, all kick would do is say ban them from the chat. They they would never do anything. But the fact that it's over many different channels and a group of individuals vtubers specifically i think is um is is definitely like it's targeted towards a certain community in the in the streaming space so we'll see if they do anything about it but um unfortunately i don't think they will but hopefully they do but again i i don't think they will um they'll just say just ban them from your channel and that's it um yeah, but I figured I would kind of go over this. I wanted to see what uh, what you guys what you guys um, uh, thought. A few day ban, but also how seriously do they take it? Look at Citrus; he got a three day ban, and that was way worse than this. I'll agree, actually. I'll agree, right? Citrus was um, doing some pretty bad things and said some bad things to that girl, and he got a three day ban. But then again, he's also got connections to Aiden Ross. He's literally Aiden Ross's assistant or whatever the heck. So obviously he's got, you know, uh, he's got a, he's got a, an exception to it. So, I mean, yeah, I don't, I don't know, dude. I don't know, but I figured I would, I would bring this up. I'm curious to see what you guys, what you, what you guys thought of this um, or, or whatnot, but uh, yeah. Yeah. 